Jay Bills from Media Spotlight UK, and I'm here with the one and only Connor Tierney in the building. First of all, how are you doing, sir? Like, I mean, obviously, I saw your face to face this morning. It it looked like it looked pretty intense. Like, uh, you know, from seeing your opponent, uh, Kyan. Like, what do you see when you look at him? Like, you know, when you saw when you did the face to face, what you what do you look what do you see when you look into his eyes? Do you know what? I see someone that's determined. He thinks he's coming to win. I think I'm coming to win, but I know I'm coming to win. You know what I mean? I, I don't think it, I know it, I believe in it. And uh, listen, he wants to take my head off. I want to take his head off. The way he was looking at me, mm. I was looking at him just the same. We locked eyes and uh, I didn't want to take my eyes off him until he took his eyes off me. Yeah, well, n none of you would let, let go of the eyes. None of you were turning away. So it's like you both are intense with your... With your um, so, I mean, obviously, you know, you got your experience in bare knuckle, yeah, yeah. Uh, nine pro bouts. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you had your recent one with uh, Jake Lindsay yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, I mean, how, how did that fight go for you in terms of like, obviously you've been experienced in this game now. Yeah. And then how did you decide that you wanted to step into the influence of boxing world? So, I've always, so Ryan Taylor, obviously I've done Ryan's Corner on a couple of shows. And uh, ever since I've done it, I was just like, I want a bit of this. Right. You know what I mean? Influencer boxing is where it's at. I'm a, a big uh, character, I'm a big personality. I might not be an influencer in the social world, but I'm an influencer in the combat world. Right. So for me, it makes sense. I'm cocky, you know what I mean? I've got a swagger, I'm a good looking lad. <laughs> and uh, yeah. it all makes sense for me to come into this game. So obviously, I ain't going to be able to fight the YouTubers unless the other YouTubers want to step up and take them fights. But for me now, fighting extra FC stars like Darren Till, that's sort of my target now. Looking for Darren Till, the ex-boxers like Carl Frotcher are still in the media, they're still hyping it up. Therefore, it's I would potentially take on influence cards. What would you say are the biggest differences in uh, bare knuckle against boxing? Because obviously you've been in this camp for a while now. So what would you say are the main, main differences? Because bare knuckle is what you're used to. Bare knuckle is just savage, cuts and breaks and bones. Um, you're allowed to hold down the back of the neck and uppercut. It's like dirty boxing. It's a bit like a street fight with no kicks. But you can't do that here. No, you can't do that here. Has it been difficult to kind of like pull yourself back away from it, knowing that's what you're used to? Uh, in terms of like, you know, in your camp and boxing? I boxed amateur though. I had 48 amateur fights, so okay. my experience is there. So I'm just switching it up. I'm here, you know, switch it up, take care now, collect the bag, and I'm on the way home, you know, you know what I mean? Back to Brum. Yeah. And of course, obviously, you know, we're in Kyan's territory in Ireland. Yeah, yeah. Um, is, you know, obviously you've been in front of different crowds before. Uh, I guess for you, it's not going to really bother you in terms of like, you know, if you're going to be the one that's booed, because obviously uh, you, the Irish are going to support him regardless. Yeah. Well, to be fair, I, I could bang on about my Irish heritage with my name like Connettini. I got a lot of family in Dublin. Okay. But listen, I'm representing Birmingham. I'm a Brummie through and through. I want to and stand up. And uh, look, Dublin's my home at the moment. I got this little mini apartment hotel thing. I feel like I'm right at home. Yeah. Don't feel like I'm away from home. No homesick here. And I'll be just at home in the boon at me and the free arena. I mean, in terms of this whole influencer game, because um, obviously you must have seen like what's been going on, obviously, with uh, KSI, the Tommy Fury. Yeah. But potentially, that's potentially a fight that's happening. But Well, hopefully, well, contract's not signed yet, but it's hopefully happening. The Jake Pauls, everything like that. When, when you got the call to be in Kingpin, like what was what was like the thought to be like, yeah, I really could fit here in, into this space? It's, you know, it, it, it's, you got to like break down the barrier of professional boxing right now. And that's no, nothing against professional boxing. I've got good friends in pro boxing. It's not entertaining. This is an entertaining sport. You know what yeah. I mean? These are not, we're not, you've not got two fighters fighting you with one that's a lot more experience. Over. They're all 50-50 fights. It's entertaining. And, you know, when I got the call for it, I was like, this is exactly what I want. I've got to get my foot in my door. Yeah, you know what course. I mean? I've got to entertain. I've got to win. Yeah. And, uh, you know what I mean? I've got to be the class clown and the slick class clown that everyone's going to love. Whilst winning at the same time. Whilst winning, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can't be a class clown and lose. That, yeah, that, that, that'll defeat the object. Um, so, I mean, in terms of the tournament, obviously that's going on. Who, you know, who out of the men and the women do you see, like, women winning the tournament? Like, you must have been keeping an eye on it. It's a hard one. Um... I do think King Kenny's got good attributes, a bit like me, he's tall, he's long, he's range, and he looks slick. Um, Jarvis, I think it'll be a Kenny Jarvis in the final. Um, yeah, that, that's what I'm saying. Jarvis has got great experience because, you know, he's training in them gyms. It's in, in such short amount of time, he's really picked it up, and you can tell that he's got it. So I can't pick a winner. If I was going to say, I'd probably say Kenny to win the tournament. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah. okay. He's got a good coach as well, so. Yeah, of course, yeah. like, uh, daily, I know him pretty well, so, like, you, you know, he's... Intelligent, he's... and he knows what he's doing, so, uh, I, you know, I think he's in the best hands. He's got the best attributes. If he uses the best attributes, long, rangy, on his feet, nice and quick, I reckon he can win. 
Do you, were you impressed by Winderson's performance uh, with his fight against Philippe? Yeah, I, I got to admit, like he was strong and he walked in down. But then again, let's look at Philippe. He was not on the level of Winderson. And what would happen if like Kenny or Jarvis fought Philippe, do you know what I mean? Like Philippe was very novice, he was very raw, do you know what I mean? He was making silly mistakes. And when you're a good fighter, regardless of how good you are, it's easier when there's a fighter that's lesser than you to make him look, look make yourself look ten times better. Sure. So we can't say, we can't judge it because styles make fights. Of course. Yeah, yeah. And then, you know, do you see this as like your future? Like obviously, would you go back to bare knuckle after this is said and done or would you still want to continue being in this space after your fight? I want to run bare knuckle and I want to run, run influence of boxing, you know what I mean? I want the influence of boxing to be a, 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 a divide into like the, almost like the entertaining ex-pros on the influencer scene. And I'd like to run that and run BKFC, you know, and just like be, I want, I want my face to be everywhere. Hmm. TV shows, adverts, I'm coming for it all. Wow. I mean, get to the levels of like KSI and Jake Paul, Tommy Furies, you want that level? Yeah, that's, that's all. You know what? I might not ever get to that level, but everything I'm doing now is working on the way to it. So wherever I stop off and wherever I get off, I'm sure it'll be a lot higher than what I'm at now. Well, I'm looking forward to your fight. It's, it's, one, of, it's, one, of those, it's one of those, like, it's one of the fights that like, I feel will just be a banger like, for yeah. you two. So I wish you all the best for your fight and uh, I wish you all the best in the future, like, even yeah. with bare knuckle in general as well. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. All right.